Hi everybody, it's Marcella Nordbeck Richardson and I am coming to you again from St. Gallery here in Denver in the heart of the Santa Fe Art District. And behind me is part of my show called Choice Points. It's a month long show. And if you missed the opening reception last week, no worries, my show is up for three more weeks. So come on down and see it. I'm here in the gallery on Thursdays, Fridays, and Saturdays. And gallery hours can be found on their website at stgallery.org. What I really want to talk to you about today is intentions and specifically setting intentions. This show would not have happened, this art show and being represented by St. Gallery, if I hadn't first set an intention. When I left my day job back in October, I set the intention that I was going to create a new body of work, a whole new series of paintings so that I could um, show more work in and around town. And I also set the intention that I was specifically working towards an art show in February. I needed a deadline, something to work towards. And by having a show in February, that would ensure that I'd have a body of work, at least those paintings that don't sell during this show. I'd still have some things left to continue to rotate in and around Denver, as well as to show in my booths when I do art markets and art festivals this summer. So my intention was kind of a big one. It was, you know, painting a whole new series, but also having a show to then fulfill the other intention of having work to rotate and have for future shows. So I set the intention. The next thing I did was I took action. I started to paint, obviously, but I also started to scout to look for a place to have the February show. And I came down to the Santa Fe Art District in November and I walked up the street a couple blocks outside of the district. I had heard about this hair salon that rotates art every month and I went and checked it out. Obviously, I'm not there. I'm not at the hair salon. It just didn't feel right. Energetically, I knew it wasn't the right place. Didn't know why. I just knew it wasn't the right place. And I kept looking. Actually, to be more specific, I just kept holding the space that the right place was going to be revealed to me. But by taking that action, I was letting the universe know that I was really serious about my intention. I was holding the space that I was going to have a show in February and I just needed the universe to guide me and tell me where to go or who to talk to. And long story short, I was connected with a member here at St. Gallery who happened to be a board member and ultimately she invited me to apply to the gallery and I did and I got in. And I'm going to talk more about that in next week's uh, video blog. Next week's blog is going to be about asking questions. This week's blog is about intentions. I just want you to think about being conscious about the things that you want to create in your life or in your business and then taking action steps. And it can be a really small action step. It can be as simple as driving to the library and checking out books just to research your idea, your dream, to then be inspired about what the next action step could be. But that action step, no matter how small and no matter how seemingly insignificant, is so important because it lets the universe know that you're really serious about your intentions and the dreams that you're ready to manifest. Lastly, after you set that intention, after you take some small action, be ready to just be guided allow the universe to show you through song lyrics through a book that lands in your lap or some chance encounter with a person just be guided and let the miracles happen and believe me they will so that's my advice for this week and remember we are all artists each and every one of us we are the artists of our own lives what are you creating today